After five years of searching for a suitable location, officials have chosen Millside Park as the construction site for a new skate park. The East Hampton Parks and Recreation Commission approved this location on September 12th, allowing the project to move forward with securing funding and construction. The new skate park will replace the former David McDonald Memorial Skate Park and is to be designed by Platform Group, integrating the skate park with the park's existing surroundings and features. I think the ways that a skate park can benefit a community is it creates a safe space for everybody to be around. It like gives people something to do other than being in their houses. A lot of people can bond over similar interests and people can make like friends. If people aren't very comfortable making friends, they can just go out to this one place. People need a, pl a safe place and maybe sometimes their house isn't that place. So it just gives especially the youth a place to be and be safe. The problem with not having a skate park in your vicinity or in your community is you don't really have anywhere else to go so you have to go like other places that you might not be allowed to like especially in the city there's a lot of security people there's a lot of like old people they're scared of skateboarding so having a safe space for it really helps i think what the committee has decided for the location is a really convenient spot it's a really good spot just because it's right along the bike path. Bike path goes to Northampton and goes to other places and there's already a park there so like families can bring their children, they can like have their kids run around, you know, frolic. Thanks for watching. Make sure to check it out once it's open and for any further questions go to the URL below.